Imagine your kidneys, two vital filters inside your body, under siege. In adults with systemic lupus erythematosus, known as SLE, the immune system turns against the body's own tissues. When those filters become a target, the result is lupus nephritis, one of the most serious complications of lupus. As immune cells misfire, they produce harmful antibodies that form immune complexes inside the kidney's delicate blood vessels. These complexes spark inflammation, causing protein leakage, swelling, rising blood pressure, and declining kidney function. Without effective treatment, many patients eventually face dialysis or a kidney transplant. Lupus nephritis affects about 1.7 million people worldwide, most of them women of color in their childbearing years. The impact on quality of life is profound, and for decades, treatment options have been limited. But a new therapy is changing that narrative. On October 20, 2025, the U.S. Food and Drug Administration approved Gaziva, also known as Obinutuzumab, for adults with active lupus nephritis already on standard therapy. Developed by Roche in partnership with Biogen and marketed in the U.S. by Genentech, Gaziva represents a major advancement, expanding beyond oncology into autoimmune kidney disease. Originally approved for blood cancers in 2013, Gaziva is now bringing hope to people living with lupus nephritis. Gaziva is a glycoengineered type 2 anti-CD20 monoclonal antibody. In simpler terms, it targets and depletes B-cells, the immune cells responsible for driving inflammation and tissue damage in lupus nephritis. By eliminating these disease-causing B-cells, Gaziva interrupts the immune cycle that damages the kidneys. This targeted approach helps preserve kidney function while maintaining immune balance. The FDA's approval was based on strong data from the Phase II Nobility and Phase III Regency trials. In the Regency trial, patients who received Gaziva alongside standard therapy achieved a 46.4% complete renal response, compared to 33.1% with standard therapy alone after 76 weeks, a meaningful and statistically significant improvement. Importantly, Gaziva's safety profile in lupus nephritis was consistent with what was previously observed in oncology settings, showing no unexpected risks. Following four initial doses in the first year, Gaziva can be administered twice yearly, offering an effective and potentially more convenient treatment option than traditional targeted therapies. This regimen supports sustained kidney protection and long-term disease remission. For patients, Gaziva marks a new era in lupus nephritis care. It targets the root cause, the overactive B cells, rather than broadly suppressing the immune system. It provides improved kidney protection and higher chances of sustained remission. And with a twice yearly maintenance schedule, it allows patients to focus more on living and less on hospital visits. Gaziva isn't a standalone cure. But when used with standard therapy under expert supervision, it offers real, measurable hope for long-term kidney health. Lupus nephritis remains one of the most serious challenges in autoimmune disease. But with the approval of Gaziva, we're witnessing progress that could redefine kidney protection and remission outcomes. This isn't just another treatment. It's a milestone. A step toward transforming how we manage lupus-related kidney disease and how patients experience life with lupus. If you found this update helpful, don't forget to like, subscribe, and follow Drug Insight Hub, your trusted source for clear, science-driven breakdowns of the world's most important drug approvals and medical innovations. Stay informed. Stay empowered. This is Drug Insight Hub, where medicine meets meaning.